So we played in Dublin, Belfast, Falmouth and Peking, Brighton, Cardiff and Bristol, Loughborough, and then we ended up in Covent Garden. And uh, we played the Miki store yesterday, which was brilliant, and uh, we played Falmouth the day before. At last I'm moving out the city of cinema, arms of a stranger, don't know where to begin, I feel, do you love, I feel, marriage, I just want to get away, I want these memories to fade. So what I like about doing the Quicksilver uh, shop tour is the fact that it's in the daytime and I get all kind of different types of people, all the little kids getting to watch me. brand ambassador for Quicksilver Women for the last couple of years and I came up with the idea to do a tour of Quicksilver shops in the UK and it's definitely something different um, and new um, to tour fashion outlets uh, but my motivation was to connect with like-minded people that are going to like my sound. <laughs> Create your own reality, and uh, we also have a long term relationship as well. And I find that that really works for us. It's very nice having the relationship and, and the business side of things as well. So we're living and breathing literally what we do with music. Last year we played the opening of a new Quicksilver store in, in Bath and uh, we played in the, in the shop window and that's the, the, where the idea of the through the glass tour came from. It's like buskers almost but <laughs> it was very different. I think it amused people because it was, it was quite different and um, we got to sell loads of CDs and get our music out into the high street. It was really good fun. See communal fire in the cause of the trouble, the job and the grain and the double elves puzzle. Look, look, cause I need to meditate. Magic is simple enough to order. some sort of way, um, being coming from a poor upbringing, we didn't have money for new clothes and um, things like that, so um, it was a case of making my own entertainment with music and art, and that's my passion in life really, is to look at um, what I've got in front of me and see what I can create out of it and to how I can turn the situation around. How long has this been going on?
you very much. I wanted to put out an acoustic album because it's something I haven't done before and it's how I've been playing live on my recent tour. Live in Covent Garden is uh, a recording that we did on the final date of the Quicksilver tour and I'm putting it out as an exclusive download on my website. And at the same time I'm putting out an EP with a few new songs on um, and that's called Acoustic Exclusives. I want to recognize your beauty is not just a mask. I want to reconcile the demons from your past. I want to satisfy the undisclosed desires in your heart. I feel like the two albums are connected, uh, but they've got their distinctive identity, so that's why I'm putting them out there like that. Mainly, I hope that people see that um, I'm about innovation and that's what's important to me and not just copying other people's songs but actually listening to my inner voice. Flying into Heathrow, I know I've got a lot to think about. It's right off the day I'm going to chill I'm back with my Thank you to everyone that owns the shop. 